guys, Messina Allen here, and welcome back to an episode of Backtrack Central! <laughs> no, this is Twilight Princess, but it really feels like Backtrack Central right now because we're going back to the central area again. Yeah, that's one thing about this dungeon. Backtracking everywhere, all the time, unfortunately. But... Gotta do what we gotta do, right, right, right. So, off we go. Ouch, no, no ouch for me today. Already ouched enough from that mini boss. All right, so, we need to go back to the central area. I think we just hop on this and then it'll take us right to it. Not this one, should be over there, right? I hope so. I probably can just hop off and then end up over there, but I, I feel like, I feel like riding the cog ride. The say is just that refined. No, not really. If anything, I'd probably be sitting on this thing and be, go be, and be going just like, Wee! All the way through. That's totally what I would do. You know those swing rides in like, in like carnivals and crap like that? Where it has like the swing and it spins around? Yeah, my hands are just up in the air and I'm just like, Wee! That was my favorite ride when I was a kid in all those like fairs and crap. I just, I always had to go on those swing rides. And now that I'm older, I'm a coward, and I'm just like, what if that chain breaks? But anyway, back to the game. <laughs> we now have water flow in this area, which opens up a lot of water down there. Actually, it didn't really open up anything, but still. Now, I need to go that way. I need to go that way, but, 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 but. But stuff is stuff is down here, and and I I want stuff that's down there because can I even go down there? I don't think I can do go down there. Wait, wait, wait! Nope, Masay got this. Masay got this because I don't want to leave this behind because I went the wrong way in the last episode, and I was just like, wait a second, I'm missing I'm missing a chest here. Totally, totally missing a chest. So let's see if I can find a way to like drop down really quick. Here we go. Drop down, let's not grab the thing, and just, bam! Aha! And here we go, and now let's see, there's like an outpost. Oh, piranha fish! No, no sir, no sir, get off of me! Wow, uh, they're ferocious little buggers. Weak, but ferocious. Anyway, now we've got that, and we can open up this! Here we go, we got a red rupee! All right, I, would, I just wanted to open that because I knew if I didn't get it now, then I would never find a way to get it later. So, actually, I probably would have. It's just that I, I didn't want to forget about it, quite frankly. Because you all know Masay's memory. Climb up, Link. Climb up. All right, there we go. Now we're going in the right direction. Anyway, now I need to find out which, which, which door I was at. Crap, what door was I at? Um, oh! Thank you, Matt, for telling me where I was. All right, so I started off there. I needed to come over here, and now... Let's see. Let's see. Um... Um, I guess I just keep going? I know, I know what I'm looking for. I'm just not entirely sure where it is. That's a story of my life right there. All the time. Alright, where is it? Where is it? I know that there's something here that I'm interested in. Now, where is it? Uh, let's see. Is this it? No, that's not it. Uh, it's not here either. What the heck do- Oh, I see it! I see it, I see it. I walked right past it. Okay, so, remember this thing? We used this and we pulled it down and it did stuff, right, in the last episode? Well, now that's a new mechanic that we can take advantage of. Do that, and da, 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 we can now access new rooms. And we have like massive amount of water coming down that way. So now this area is flooded. And the door behind us is now able to be accessed. Well, we could always access it, but this thing wasn't spinning, so we couldn't actually do anything with it. But still, in fact, I think this is where I got lost at one time. I was just like, let's go into this door. Derp, derp, derp. And then I just ended up being like, nope, this isn't for me. Anyway, so now this way is open for us to go exploring. Yay! Okay, so now we're in this room. 
guess we just kind of jump across with the bottomless pit below us. Oh crap! Oh, uh, that's that's not that's not promising. Okay, you know that makes me wonder just how far down this temple goes. Okay, so I don't want to get bitten by bats. I don't want to get bitten by bats. Let's see. Here we go. Here's a metal here. If we ever see these things, pull it. Uh, can I just move this? There we go. That's the nifty thing about claw shots. You can just gently, gently put yourself down. Take this open, and we got some water bombs. Ten of them. I have way too many of these things. Seriously, speaking of, I should probably equip them. Uh, there we go, and there we go. I'm good. The say is good. I swear, I don't really need all these bombs. It's just that I end up with them anyway. Okay, so let's see. Where am I going? Where am I going? Ah, here we go. I swear, the claw shot, just like the hook shot, gives you like whiplash every time you use it. It's just like, I'm gonna claw this thing and then nope. My neck is dead. Neck is dead. All right, now I want to go up here. Let's see if I can like claw shot right there so that we, we don't have to like shimmy over too much. Shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. No, no, stop climbing down. There we go. And now, what's over there? More kelp. More stuff. And stuff, okay. So, here we go. <laughs> There we go. Got it. Feel like I'm missing a treasure chest in here though. But I can't see it because freaking lack of compass. I'm just gonna take a quick look around. Just a quick look around. Actually, I see something over there that's of interest. Mm, is it worth it? Is it worth it? Is it worth it? It's, it's, it. If it's not worth it, then I'll, I'll, I'll do so Wow, bad aim. So I totally did miss something, and it's right over there. I'm so smart I didn't ha actually have to kill myself there. Nicely done. All right, now I feel better. I got myself my red rupee. That was so worth killing myself over. $20, killed myself for $20. Anyway, so now I got that. I'm happy, okay? <laughs> I, I, I need my monies, okay? I apparently need my monies, even though I have enough of it to, like, last me forever. I swear, I get so much money from this dungeon crawling business, it's not even funny. Alright, so, off we go to this door, and now we're ready to head on out. Okay, I believe I got everything. If not, oh well, too bad, I'm done. Anyway, so, now we're in here. We look up there, there's some stalactite. Now, just do that. Boom, and that does that. Let's see, ooh, there's one of these things. Hey, buddy, I don't have to bomb you anymore. I can just pluck you out of that and slash you up to my heart's content. Aha! Uh, wow, the chew actually dies with it. That's a very respectable chew. Choo-choo, choo-choo, you were so respectable, choo-choo. Anyway, there's a gate there. I need this to come back down. There we go. Hop up. Come on, blast it up. Over the Uh, no, I'm supposed to jump over. Okay. Jump down. Who wants some of this? You two want some of this? You want some of this? Bam! Oh, one shot. One shot, one shot. Okay, I, I can't get up there. Unless I do this. Yay! Drop down. And off to this room. And another one of these. Two more of these. Great. Okay, there we go. He's done. And this guy is also done. I like killing things and not using my resources to kill them. Like bomb arrows. Bomb arrows are very resource intensive. Boo hoo, I'm using up one arrow and one bomb. Both of which I'm getting so freaking often. Anyway, so we got that. Now we need to go into this room. Open this. Let's see. Let's see. Did I do good? I need to sink down there, don't I? Totally do. Alright, so iron boots. Jump down. And let's see what's in here. Uh, can, can I kill you? Can I kill you? 
Oh, not you. You. Uh, hey, I can kill it at long last. Uh, I don't know about you. Oh, sweet, I can. Kill it, kill it. Kill it and then eat it. Uh, uh, is it gonna die anytime soon? Am I supposed to, like, blow it up? Whoa! I probably am supposed to, like, blow it up. Whoa! Okay, yeah, that, that is what I'm supposed to do. Sweet. Got that. Hey, buddy. Death to you! I pull out your brain and... Wow, I don't even need to slash it. I just need to pull its brain out. Then again, I would think that that would kind of kill anything and everything, right? Yeah. Anyway, there we go. We got a red rupee here. And now, go back up. Swim up. Swim up. There we go. Uh, how do I get out of here? Uh, I see kelp there. I can't see anything else, but I saw kelp there. Uh, was there anything else of note in here? Or did I just come in here prematurely? I think I came in here prematurely because that's not moving. Oh well. At least I got the red rupee. Okay, so let's see. Is this a door? If this is... No, it's not a door. So, wait a second. Then what the... Oh! Oh! Masay is derp. Masay is so derp. Okay, so this! Remember this? Yeah, I remember this too. Let's go up here. This is kind of like the eastern portion of this whole thing. So we have to walk up here. You know, can I, can I do this? Can I do this? No, I can't. Oh well. It was worth a shot. I have some, like, time-saving times. Ooh, okay. We can do this, though. And I'm, I have a feeling I'm supposed to wait for that to go away, or else I'm going to get slapped upside the head with a big burst of water. And that would be bad. Alright, so now up we go, up we go, up the water slide, up the water slide, see the water slide, and there. You know, you guys are in a really, really bad spot, because if this is anything like the other area, you guys are going to get swept away, and you know, you have like armor, you're going to sink and drown and die, like everything else in here. Anyway, so, let's see. Let's go ahead and claw shot over to that side. I'm standing way too far away. And there we go. Yay! Drop down, and then treasure chest! It's something important! We got the compass! This handy tool will show you where to find objects hidden in this dungeon. Just like every other compass in every other Zelda game. But anyway, let's go ahead and not close our mini map, but open up our big map and see how many freaking things we need to we need to find in here. Wow, there's quite a few more treasure chests for us to find. Okay, well, off to work we go. Okay, so now let's hop off of here, climb up these ladders. Climb up these ladders, I say. Up the ladders, Masay says. And then, let's see, jump carefully. And that opens up the waterway. And make this pretty, pretty slide once again. And down we go. Wow, these guys are too heavy to be swept away by the water. Um, I guess I lied. These guys aren't going to be, like, instant deaded. Oh, great, piranha fish. Nope! Die! You guys weren't there before! At least you weren't hostile when I was swimming around in there. There we go, gotta continue that water flow. So this dungeon, like I said, is all about the water flow. Gotta love it. Uh, no, let's go this way. That's right, monkey bar time! Drop down, and we are good. But, I think we've done enough for one episode. 
quite frankly, I'm afraid that I'm going to get lost in those two doors. <laughs> like I did the last time. I'm just like, you know, I wonder what happens if I go through the right door. I, I have a feeling I'm supposed to go through the left, but eh, eh, eh. Well, at least I got a ferry out of it, so I'm not complaining too much, but still. Anyway, so we've done a lot for one episode. We got another source of water flow going, and it's going two separate ways this time. So next time we'll be seeing what kind of effect this water flow has on the rest of the dungeon. Until next time, I will see you guys later. Messinella, out. Thank you.